All right, we're finding the x-intercepts of a quadratic. To find the x-intercepts, the same as fun plugging 0 in for y and solving for x. So this is what we will have. x equals negative b, which is 4, plus or minus the square root b squared, which is 16, minus 4 times a times c, which is negative 5. 2 times the a is 4, and then we simplify from there. 4 plus or minus 4 times 2 times 5 is negative 5 is a negative 40. So I have 16 minus a negative 40 is really 16 plus 40. Still over 4. And then next step, we have 4 plus or minus the square root of 56 all over 4. x equals 4 plus or minus. Now we need to break 56 down. The factors are 4 and 14. I choose those because 4 is the largest perfect square factor. The square root of 4 is 2, which I will put on the outside, 2 radical 14. And then to simplify further, I will take out a 2 from the top and the bottom. top I'm left with 2 plus or minus radical 14. This 2 and this 2 cancel, giving me an answer of 2 plus or minus square root 14 all over 2. And that is our two answers to the quadratics. It's also the two y-intercepts.